Hey guys, today we are going to be harvesting my Roma lettuce and my um, jalapenos. So they're pretty easy. Um, I'm in my garden right now. So all you have to do is you take it where there's a little new babies. You grab a hold of it. Like uh, this. And then everything you're not grabbing, you can pull off. So when you pull off, you want to grab it and you want to pull down. And I'm just going to keep doing those. I'm going to keep doing those. And I will come back with you guys when I'm done with that. I'll see you in a little. Alrighty, guys. I'm done harvesting the lettuce. We got a pretty good amount. Now we're going to go over to our jalapenos. So it looks like we have two nice looking jalapenos. Um, Dad, I beat you this year, I think, on growing peppers. My dad normally grows a lot of peppers and he's pretty good at them. But this year, I beat him. So this year, all you have to do, well, all any time, you just take it and you kind of just pull it off. And then you have a nice pepper like that. We only have two, but there's gonna be like a like maybe five more coming um we haven't seen any more we haven't seen any peppers on these and i don't i don't i kind of might know why there's no pepper on those it's because i was in a rush when i was planting them and i had to um like plant them together so now that we have that planted we could come over to our rosemary because we could just harvest our rosemary too now you could use your finger now or you could use some scissors, but all you really do is you just pick it off just like that. Put it in there. With rosemary, you could walk you well, just the wind. Hope this guy's just affecting the quality. But you grab it like that, you pinch it off. Rosemary. And you wanna try to go for the biggest pieces that you could find. And yeah. So our tomatoes are going to be funner harvesting, but they're not really going to be coming in and like, oh, wind, wind, wind. The only re the reason why I always say wind and I'm scared of the wind is because I realize that it cuts out on my videos, so I'm scared of the wind. Um, but anyways, we are done harvesting for, th for today. We're going to go clean them off inside. And I will come back with you guys when I'm inside. I'll see you when I'm inside. Peace. All right, so we now are now inside, and we have my um, stuff we're ready to harvest. And, well, clean. So, first, I'm actually going to put on some gloves. Still in the same onesie as well, a few days ago. I only wear this when I come home and... Sleeping, just chill. I put my clothes on real quick. Scrubs are hard to put on. But anyways, I got my gloves on, and we're gonna get ready. So we are going to take the aroma lettuce. I also found some, got some dill. Cause I replanted my dill, and it kind of looked dead. So I just picked the most off. So we are going to take the lettuce. I see some rosemary in that. There's some rosemary. Okay, we're just gonna plop it in there. It's a bucket of water and we're gonna kind of just let them sit. Okay, let them sit for like maybe 20 seconds or 10 seconds. Um, and then we are going to grab some napkins to lay all of our stuff off on. I will show you guys what that looks like when I am done laying them off. And I will come back to you guys in a little when I'm ready to, um, to, like, do the next part and get all everything ready. Anyways, I'll see you in a little. Bye. Alright, so this is the last part of my video. So we have my stuff laid out. We have my lettuce in here. 
Roma lettuce. So we're just gonna take it out. I'm gonna give it a little shake. Now, so, normally you would spin this to get all of the stuff out, but we don't have a spinner. And we are going to put it down right there. Let it dry. I thought I had two, two peppers. Might have left it outside, but I guess we did some rosemary too. There's only one pepper in here, but it's kind of the same with the other stuff. You're kind of just washing it the best you can, trying to get all the any dirt off of it as possible. And then when you bag it up, you want to put a little towel in there so all the water gets off. So I am done with this. And this is going to be the end of my video right here. I'm going to sort this stuff and put them into bags. Um, and yeah, I hope you guys liked the video. Hope you guys come back for another video, hopefully. Um, please like and subscribe because um, I really like doing these videos and I like people watching them because I know they get, they learn stuff. So please like and subscribe. Um, if you have anything to tell me in the comments, just let me know. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video.